the honeymoon was in full swing on Thursday as newly married Nicola Hughes and Charlie Tupper let their hair down in Mauritius, where they were joined by close friend Montana Brown. Nicole and businessman Charlie tied the knot in a lavish sari ceremony last Saturday, and have since been enjoying their tropical surroundings at the LUX Asterisk Grand Bay Resort in the north of the picturesque island. Hitting the beach during their latest appearance, Nicola showed off her slender physique in a tasteful white top and matching skirt from online retailer Pretty Little Thing. She added to her look with a pair of strappy white heels, but they were left on dry land as she stretched out on a sun lounger and topped up her tan. Meanwhile Love Island star Montana, currently enjoying a sunshine break at the same lavish resort. Ensured she turned heads in a bronze-colored bikini as she ventured out on a paddleboard. Accompanied by an instructor, Montana was in high spirits as she tried her hand at the popular water sport, but appeared to lose her composure while struggling to stay afloat. Planned in just six weeks Nicola and Charlie's blowout ceremony took place at beautiful Botley's mansion and had the likes of Lottie Moss and bridesmaids Tiffany and Lucy Watson in attendance alongside 105 other guests. Speaking about their big day for the first time in a new interview, the couple revealed that their nuptials were originally set to take place across three days abroad, however, they were forced to make other plans due to the pandemic. It was hectic and a little stressful but we're so happy we were able to make it work, Nicola, who has been with Charlie for five years, told OK. Magazine Also sharing that she took control of the wedding herself and did not use a wedding planner, the TV personality added, I decided to take on the task myself. Asked how it feels to be husband and wife, Charlie gushed. Everything feels a lot more special. I have this ring on my finger now and I never wear rings, so it feels really weird. We just have so much to look forward to now. On the day, Nicola looked stunning in a chic bon bride dress and the couple, who became engaged in Ibiza last summer, exchanged bespoke rings, with the bride even doing her own hair. Nicola and Charlie's fast dance was to Beautiful Song at Last, which they practiced at home before the big day, and guests tucked into a three-course wedding breakfast consisting of prawns on a bed of tomatoes, slow-cooked beef and an apple and raspberry crumble to finish. Guests also enjoyed an impressive 40 wedding cake composed of a carrot, chocolate, lemon and red velvet layer. Once their vows had been exchanged, an eight-piece band kicked off the post-ceremony party, which went on until 3 a.m. Guests were also asked to take lateral tests before arriving at the venue, with Charlie telling the magazine that one person had tested positive meaning they weren't able to be part of their big day. Nicola revealed that her favorite part of the day was unplanned, and happened when venue organizers pulled them aside and took them to a room to spend time alone and let everything sink in. I felt so grateful, Nicola said of the gesture. Looking to the future, she added that she and her husband are excited to start planning their honeymoon, buy a house and one day start a family.